Hello. Yes, uh, sir. Uh, yeah, Can you tell me about yourself? There is no name. I'm an artist. Artists. Kevin Pansu, Christ Fiend. Who is it? What kind of art do you do? Um, animals. Animals. Big five. Yeah. Kevin Patterson was one of the most uh, profound promoters of Zimbabwean art. Did you ever have a chance of meeting up with him? No, no, I, I never had the chance, unfortunately, because uh, he was he was dead way, 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 way back before we got here. So how did you get into the industry? My father was an artist. Is it? What's his name? Uh, Edward Arpanet. And uh, what do you think is the state of the art industry in Zimbabwe at this point in time? In terms of in terms of marketing or in terms of everything, everything. Uh, in terms of marketing, is a bit on the downside. But in terms of the works, uh, because marketing is a bit on the downside, uh, there are less you know, young people willing to to learn the trade now because it's not very lucrative at the moment. To, to in the levels where in, back in the day, it was very, very lucrative. Every young man who comes from school would want to, to be an artist. Nowadays, they don't want. What do you think is the problem? What's, 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 what's happening? Uh, I'm sure it could be a number of problems. Maybe, I don't know, maybe there are more artists nowadays and fewer buyers, you know? something or maybe exposure or maybe politics you never know you never really can explain things in Zimbabwe you know? so and would you say that uh, Zimbabwean art has become cheap since uh, not really not really not really we have become as, as far as Mbasa as far as works productions as far as quality of works it's much better now than it was back in the day you find uh, back in the day you just do Madara used to do very simple pieces like, you know, Nowadays, young contemporary art should got more detail, better finishes, different concepts and things. There's a lot of things that's going on nowadays. But just that, I don't know, I don't know, maybe, I, I'm not sure why the marketing is a bit low nowadays, but as far as artwork is concerned, we are at a better level than big then. Much better. Is, right. it, is there actually, anything, that you, anything else that you want to say? Like, like probably that you just feel like as an artist, inspiration, anything? No, art, art is, is good. It's a, it's a good place to, you know, to relieve stress. Art. When you're doing art, you're at a different mental state, you know, you're relaxed, you know, some of us, I feel very relaxed and at ease when I'm doing this thing, you know. it's nice, it's a good thing, it's, it helped me, especially me, my life, as far as uh, emotionally, mentally, it's just good, it's, just, it's one of those things that, you know, that people, take for granted in very, very important in society and in, you know, in society and in the development of, of human beings and Africans especially as a people. You know, we preserve these things. You know, maybe my days I don't know my my dinosaur comes to my teeth. Otherwise we wouldn't be guessing what dinosaurs would be. Uh, maybe from a hundred years from now, elephants will be extinct because of artists, because of elephants that are being carved. People would know this is how an elephant used to look like. It was such an animal for an elephant. This is how it used to look like. This is how Africans used to look. How African women used to do their hair. You know? Maybe my days, oh, I can't know what animals do. <laughs> African women used to keep hair, you know, those kind of things.
at the preserved society in nature is, you know, at living. Then if you go and look at the man, great Zimbabwe archaeological or churches, no chair was easy. The article that tells us what all oh, the people of Zimbabwe used to live like this. How many man is Zimbabwe bed there? The art is a work of art. It's a work of art. It's a work of art. It's artists that were doing things that in those days. So the art is good. It's a beautiful thing.